so in this video i will show you my diy vacuum filtration equipment that i have made myself okay this is a buchner funnel so what i did i took a empty cream container and made holes inside this with the help of an hot iron nail okay then i sanded the inner surface to make the surface smooth then i used epoxy putty and sealed the container with this normal funnel then i used epoxy putty to join a syringe pipe with this funnel and also placed a hose for vacuum uh, pump now this syringe pipe fits very well into this flat bottom flask of b24 fitting now this can be connected to a vacuum like this vacuum pump also i have made myself you can see that this is a syringe now there are two walls inside this i have used epoxy putty to seal the joints so one wall is in in this direction and one wall is in outward direction you can see that i have used syringes syringe cap you can see that i have used syringe cap and i have made holes inside the cap and this is a rubber sleeve which is used as a valve now air can come out of this but cannot enter same valve i have placed over here in this direction it is manually pumped like this you can see now i will connect this tube into this pipe and then i can use my vacuum filtration so one is this now another thing i that i have made is is this gooch funnel so this was a empty sprinkler bottle you can see that th there is a disc in which holes are there so this was a empty sprinkler bottle i cut it into a half sealed the cap with epoxy putty and also over i have attached a glass tube okay now this can be connected onto this flask with this two hole cork like this and this tube can be connected to vacuum so this uh, this is sorry not good funnel this is hirsch funnel it is a uh, mo uh, generally a small buckner funnel we use it for small uh, uh, filtrations so this is this was my diy vacuum filtration setup now i will show you a demonstration also so first we place a filter paper which is cut in the size of the buchner funnel then the filter paper is wetted by water and vacuum is applied to form a seal between the filter paper and the funnel now it is ready to vacuum filter so i am filtering off this precipitate using vacuum filtration so the precipitate and the solution is poured into the funnel and you can see that on applying vacuum the solution quickly filters off all the liquid is drained into the flask and the precipitate is left behind on the filter paper so this is another footage again i am filtering precipitate from using buchner funnel thanks for watching my video please like share comment and subscribe to my youtube channel i would like to thank aga for financially supporting me 
You can also support me financially through Patreon and PayPal. Links are given in description.